Hey guys, Herf here. Welcome to another episode where we try to survive and thrive here on the Lost Island. Um, we are down here just below, I guess just south of uh, the volcanoes and the Red Obelisk. Um, my goal here was to was to fly back. That's our wyvern right there. We flew back over here. And what I wanted to do was find that cave that we went into uh, when we were trying to run away from the wyverns that were attacking us in the trench. Um, we went into a little cave. There was some mantis in there and things like that. So I came over here uh, and I needed food for the berry. So I threw the berry in the water and we started swimming around and I found this hole right here. Um, and it looks pretty deep and I, I don't have my scuba gear or anything. Yeah, there's just a ton of piranha here, which is good because that's the food that we've been eating. So anyway, if you guys know where this goes, uh, let me know in the comments, uh, or else I'll just, uh, you know, I'll come back and explore it. Um, maybe later on in the episode, if we can get through this cave, like, quick. This is damn... Get up here where I can bite you. There you go. So, we successfully got uh, kind of a ton of food. I guess we killed one of those ducks. I'm not going to carry ten, so... Got a good amount of food for him for the cave, so uh, that'll be good. So anyway, I'm going to jump back on the wyvern. We're going to head over, try to find this cave again, and uh, we will bring it back when I find it. Okay, I don't know what these magmasaurs are fighting, but they're, they're in the water over here. This is one under the water. <laughs> they have aquatic magmasaurs as well. Uh, okay, I'll bring it back when we find the... Uh, the cave entrance here. Alright guys, so this is the entrance to the cave that we snuck into uh, evading the wyvern. So I don't know if this is an artifact cave or, or what, but uh, let me throw on my torch. Yeah, there's a mantis in here, so... be really quick if we start keeping everything. Really? Dung beetle wants some. Jeez, okay. Yeah, okay, this is it, because we saw a crystal over here, so... walking around on a wyvern, but we're uh, just trying to see what's what's maybe here. Looks like this is just... Oh, Alright, so it's not really an artifact cave, maybe. Okay, so it's just a, a cave of refuge. So uh, I will keep looking and bring you guys back. Alright, guys, uh, we are back. We finally found... Uh, the entrance to this cave. I, I I think I flew by it about 12 times. Um, so this is that little lake that we were actually in. Let's see if I can uh, can show you where that hole is. Uh, is this the... Yeah, I think this is the lake. Yeah, so there's a deep-ass hole right here in this, in this lake. Anyway, so the entrance to the cave is right here. So, uh, like, do... I guess east of the uh, of the red obelisk uh, on the you know the other volcano mountain. Oh, there's a red drop. We should go get that before we get in. Is this sort of uh, little half circle um, opening? And in the back corner over here is the entrance to the cave. So 
Um, I've got the Baryonyx down here. I've put a couple of um, bedrolls down. Uh, and uh, my issue was that it was guarded by some trees. <laughs> so I couldn't see it because of trees. Uh, I'm going to go grab this red drop, and then I will bring it back, and we're going to head into the cave. All right, guys, so we got uh, a blueprint for Ascendant Flat Gauntlets. Pretty good. Don't look super expensive. Uh, the armor is is pretty high, so that those would be great. And we got... I don't need the C4 charge or the shotgun shells. And we got some ghillie boots. Um, so we are good to go in here. I've got enough supplies to repair our torch a couple times. And uh, we are ready to go. So... We've got the Sinnoh with us, uh, so I do want to be a tiny bit careful. I don't want to get it killed, although it is replaceable. Everything we have is replaceable except my long neck. So I don't know what to expect in here. I have never been in here. And uh, it's, I do like the purple. That's pretty cool. I'll keep my torch out as long as we can. So I believe this is an artifact cave, although maybe we have to find um, another entrance. I don't need my torch, it's making me hot. Oh, oh god, this reminds me of the lava cave on the island. Oh. This way. Oh, this place is nuts. Hey, remind me not to fall in here. Oh, holy crap. Now let's come all the way in here to get crystal. That's easy. I have no idea where I'm even going. I'm assuming that this is not the right way to go. We want to go back up over that bridge, but... Maybe there's multiple entrances? I just don't know. Okay. is not uh, well this looks like water doesn't it not not lava right. let's not take that leap of faith This little ramp we could look at. Oh my. <laughs> Am I? Okay. And what do we have there? Oh, 
Is this just regular crystal? What is this? Yep, red mushroom is regular crystal. Okay. And we don't need those. So that's just a little tiny crystal room. Now apparently I get a look in every crack and crevice now. Um, Alright, I'm going to make my way back and we're going to go up the uh, the big ramp here in the beginning of the cave. Alright, so we're going to head up here. There was a, was a spot down there. In fact, it's right right above my head that you can see. I almost look like we could jump across over there, but I guess it does go through. Alright, so we'll keep an eye on that. Uh, I don't know if that's the right way to go. This kind of looks... Like the way to go ish. I had to guess. Uh, maybe that comes through there. I don't really know. Okay. Just a little dead end, okay. Place is insane. Let's try this one. Haven't seen a single creature yet. Not that I'm complaining. I just want an artifact. <laughs> uh, what is happening? Wow, okay, we just had some major lag right there. Uh, so we must have just loaded the cave. I'm only wearing cloth armor, man. I do have a full canteen. Hopefully one canteen is good. is so far very big. No, oh, that's not full of lava there. Okay. both go to the same place it looks like okay and our baryonyx pooped oh it continues down there holy cow well this looks like uh well i think that's gold or metal um This continues. Holy cow. Man, okay. not loving anywhere we have to jump. So I'm going to ignore that jump for the moment. Oop. 
All right, let's head up this ramp. There's, is that an artifact? Oh, this must be it. Okay. the immune. So, this was uncontested. What do you say? Oh, we took a leap of faith. Okay, probably shouldn't have done that. <laughs> uh. Does this go anywhere? here. Right? I guess I could have looked up. Well, that's a really easy way to get out. This is going to be that little crystal cave that we found in the beginning. Um, yeah, this is that little circular crystal cave. Well, okay guys, that was um, that was pretty easy to find the artifact, honestly. And we did not, uh, I haven't encountered a single creature in here. So uh, again, single player Xbox, I don't know if this is, uh, you know, a fully baked thing yet, but all I really wanted to get out of this was the artifact. I was hoping for a couple of uh, maybe drops, but I mean, the heck with it. Let's get out of here with the artifact and and be happy. So, uh, all right, I will bring you guys back. Maybe we'll go get our gear and explore that uh, that giant sinkhole. Okay, guys, I just wanted to bring you back and show off this a little bit. Um, so I've gone ahead. We took the RG. We went up to the backside of our metal mountain here. We grabbed uh, a bunch of obsidian, and uh, we crafted up 11 uh, different artifact pedestals. Because I believe there are 11 artifacts on this map. Uh... Unless there's not an 11th one on the Xbox version, I'm not sure. Um, but, so this is, uh, I think this is the Cunning, right? Yep, okay, this is Artifact of the Cunning, kind of a purple one. This is, I think, the second one we got. That was the one we got uh, in the cave with the ship. Um, this is the Skylord, I believe this is the first one we got. Uh, this was in a cave, kind of on the uh, over here behind the green obelisk. And this is uh, the immune, the one we got today. Um, immune, right? Yeah. Okay. So we have uh, purple, orange, and red. So hopefully we get some uh, green or blue ones uh, coming up next. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go ahead and gear up, uh, grab our uh, dive equipment and all that, and then I will bring it back in the morning over at this uh, giant sinkhole. All right, guys, so we are back over the hole here. Uh, let's go ahead and throw on... I do have the Sinnoh with me. I assume that the Sinnoh cannot drown, but I don't know that for sure. So let's hope he doesn't drown. Uh, all right, get these things on. So this isn't the uh, most ideal creature for going uh, straight down, but... He did really well for us in uh, in our ocean adventures, so... Is this really just a hole? Wow. <laughs> okay.
right, guys. Well, that was hugely disappointing. Uh, that was simply a very small... Uh, I don't even know what you call it. A little sinkhole. And down there were just uh, a handful of uh, silica pearls. And that was honestly it. Uh, there's nothing else down there. I went up and down it a few times. Uh, to make sure there wasn't like a cave in the side somewhere. And there is not. So at least not that I could see. So we're going to go look for some different adventure here real quick. We'll be right back. Alright guys, so we are off the east coast here. Um, sorry, I'll show you here. I've left the wyvern on neutral sitting here on the coast. Uh, where we are on the map is way up here. So we're not far from where we were. Um, I happened to see an Ovis uh, walking around, so we killed it. Got a bunch of raw mutton, which is on this alligator right now. And uh, according to Dodo Dex, we can use that to tame us a uh, plesiosaur. So I'm going to ride around looking for a plesiosaur. Um, I gotta put on my scuba gear. <laughs> so let's do that. And, uh, yeah, we got about a half an hour on this, um, on this mutton. So I'm hoping I can find one, knock it out, and, uh, I don't care what level it is. I've never tamed one. I just want to have one to ride around. <laughs> so we'll bring you back, uh, if I can find one. found a couple. I only need one. <laughs> Lovely, you guys. You both are pretty lousy. Need to separate you. out of stamina again. I don't know how that happens. Oh 
frig off? Lost the plesiosaur yet again. There he is. out. Okay. Kill this idiot here. Okay. And of course we got oh, the dolphin. So let's take the mutton. Transfer the mutton to me. Come over here. Pull that manta ray. Do I not have flippers on? Oh, I'm right. I'm exhausted. Possibly ride on the friggin' alligator without, without losing all of my stamps. So let's give you. All the mutton, and hope that works. Mutton. Right. Level 10. I think we killed the level 70. Good news is he should tame quick. Alright guys, well we got ourselves a level 14 plesiosaur. I do not have a saddle for him, so I'm going to have to go back and make one, but, uh, all right, yes, yeah, stop following me so I can get a look at you. So I've never had a please eat before. Oh, man, you are ugly. <laughs> all right, guys. Well, uh, as always, thank you guys so much for watching. If you find yourself enjoying what we do, do throw us a like, a comment, consider subscribing if you're new here, as all these things do help us out in the end. And as always, I look forward to seeing everybody in the next one.